Hello guys, so I would like to show you my idea about a holster for a flashlight. Okay, very simple holster, but I think it's uh, very effective. Uh, this was my first one that I put in together just like, uh, just like uh, before midnight and I used this clip uh, from a gun holster. Um, doesn't really work very well, but it still uh, does the job. Okay. The basic, uh, well, yeah, the basic about this thing is just uh, the flashlight will just clip in nicely and stays in nicely. Like, for example, these flashlights, this is 26, this is two batteries, 26, uh, 650, and they just come with uh, this. Uh, cord here, which is absolutely useless. I don't know who's going to carry the flashlight like this. And if you want to use both hands, then I guess uh, stick it in a pocket uh, or in your mouth. I don't know. How about this one here? Right? What are you going to do with this? If you want to have a nice powerful flashlight outside and you need both hands to carry something, well, tough luck. So anyway, this was my first one. Not very impressive, so I'm gonna leave this one out. But the nice thing about it is, it just will fit uh, like uh, these flashlights. They come with this uh, flimsy uh, clip, okay? And many of them have like really bad flip, uh, clips. So to find a good flashlight that you want with a good clip, it's like almost impossible. But uh, the nice thing about that is once you make this thing, it will fit to many different flashlights as long as it's the you know similar body size like uh, like this one here. It's a different one, but it has a similar body size. It has this stupid clip again, but it will fit, right? It's a little bit tighter, but it will fit. It will do the job. All right, so. Let's leave this one out and let's go to this one. This is my uh, second one that I made. And on this flashlight I had to actually smooth this out because this was, uh, for some reason, had a really, um, really sharp edges and uh, it was getting stuck. If I was going to take this out, pretty much that's how, it, that's how I take it out when it's on me. Okay, like this. And right here it would get stuck and I couldn't take it out. So. So anyway, that's, uh, that's uh, one type that will actually swivel, okay, you can carry it like this, and it will hold, I tell you, okay, you can hear how it clips nicely, it's not coming out, it might slide down on you, but it will get stuck on the head, or it will, this part is a little bit uh, wider too, so if you carry it like this, it will get stuck right here, and it's not sliding anymore, and it's not coming out either. So it's a nice, uh, nice, uh, uh, tight uh, uh, fit. Okay, the Kydex is uh, 0 0.060, which is about, I believe it's one millimeter Kydex, and the same, the clip. One millimeter clip, I mean one millimeter kydex, same thing. And so uh, let's let's look at how it's built, okay? Pretty much you have to mold this. It will help if you use uh, something like this maybe to do that, okay? These pliers, or you can use uh, whatever. You know, just get creative. First, you bend these edges, just like that. So it's going to have a nice uh, landing, uh, smooth uh, landing uh, uh, clip here, I mean strip, whatever. Okay, you bend these and then don't bend this around the flashlight because it's not going to be a tight fit. You have to find something a little bit uh, smaller, like for example, for this flashlight, I use the three quarter inch copper pipe, okay, and just and just mold it around it. For this one, 
I use one inch copper pipe, I believe. Uh, yeah, it is. Here is the one inch copper pipe. That's the one I use. I just mold it so see it's loose on the pipe. But uh, when I get it on the flashlight, because the pipe is a little bit smaller than the flashlight, it's a beautiful quick uh, fit. Okay? And then you're gonna just get a piece like that of the Kydex. Again, drill the hole here, drill the hole here, uh, get one of those, uh, one of these. Uh, whatever you call them, I can't remember the, ra the name right now for it. Smash it on the other side and uh, it's done. And you can make it as tight as you want, right? Now let me show you the beauty of it, okay? Pretty much uh, the clip is, uh, again, it's bent a couple times. So it just clips on the belt but it doesn't come off, this one. This one will go on the belt, but will come off. That's for a bigger flashlight. That's for this one here. Okay. But uh, this one, I, I just, I just make two different types, I guess. So let me show you how it, how it's gonna get 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 on your on your belt. All right. Position this a little bit better. Let me get in the distance. Okay, so very easy. Put it on on the belt. Okay, goes like this. Oh, one more thing I forgot to mention. Why is this not in the in the middle, in the center? Well, why? Because if I want to carry the flashlight like this, high up, see how high it is to my to my waist. I can carry it like that, or I can carry it low, like this, right? And then it's almost uh, even with my with my belt. Now, the beauty of this, you you can you don't have to just carry the flashlight like this. You can also well, you can also use it. Okay, turn it on, turn it like that, and you can go with the flashlight around, obviously and it will do the job for you. You don't have to hold it, you, you got a free hands. That's what I mean, okay? Then you can turn it like that, shut it off, or you can turn it like this. Either way, it will do the job, okay? If you wanna remove it, you can remove it this way, or you can remove it this way, it doesn't matter, but pretty much two fingers on the clip here, just like that. And your thumb on the flashlight and that's it and it's out okay I would not just pull on it because it might uh, after a few pulls it it, it it does have a really good the grip on the flashlight so it's it's better if you do it like that you can flip it around whatever right again push on the Push uh, with your two fingers on the uh, um, you know, on the kydex here, and it's out. And you can use it, whatever. Then you put it back in, right? To remove it, again, it's a little bit tricky because it has a hook, but it's not very difficult. You can even leave it on, leave it, and use it like this. For this one, then, for this one here. Again, I use uh, actually this one. I have to use uh, these uh, one inch, uh, one inch uh, couplings for one inch pipe and just mold it on this one inch coupling. But I did not use the uh, uh, twisting option here because this is a pretty heavy flashlight and I don't want to hang it only on one of these uh, nipples, whatever you call those things, I don't know. So I I use, uh, I pretty much attach it on the both sides and you can also make it from one piece if you like, okay? If you cut it right, whatever, I have a bunch of little pieces so I just piece it together and it's much easier. And this one will go, 
much easier on, on a belt. Okay, just slide in, and the flashlight goes in like that. And again, if you might jump with it or whatever, it's gonna slide down on you, even though it's pretty difficult. But it will stop at the end right here. It's not gonna go any farther than that. Okay, this is it. In a worst case. In a worst scenario case. But again, take it out. Two fingers. And this one is really, actually, much tighter than the other one. Because it's uh, much bigger too. And uh, that's it. You can even carry this flashlight if you want around. But, uh, I don't know, it might not be very comfortable, but if you go outside like me, feed the animals, so I, I have a little farm, so, you know, you carry something with one hand, let's say food, and you're going to carry the flashlight in the other hand, and then uh, you need a third hand to open the door, to open the cage, whatever. This way, just throw it in here, if you want to carry this one, or you can carry this one, right, you don't even... And this one here, you don't even have to. You see how nicely this comes out. Just slides in, slides out. And this one, with the hook, it's a little more difficult, but still doable. You don't have to take your belt off. That's the beauty of it. And this one, you can just turn it on. It's a hands-free. Just like that. All right? So, and anyway, and you can adjust it this way, you can adjust it this way, around your belt, of course, okay? Or, if you have eyes in the back of your head, you can even shine in the back. But I don't know who does. Anyway, yeah, it was just a joke. But, uh, that's it. That's, uh, that's the idea behind the Kydex, uh, holster and like I said like if you have a smaller flashlight you know small size like ah, this might not exactly small but uh, small it's not as as heavy as the big one then you can uh, use this version here you know with uh, nice uh, swivel and this clip if you want or you can have a disc clip here it depends how far you're gonna go with it or how, how often you're gonna take it off and on. This will be if you just wanna throw in for five minutes and go outside and come back. Right? You don't wanna fight with this uh, hook at the bottom. And this would be if you wanna maybe carry it around campfire or carry it for a couple hours or something like that. Then I would make the hook at the bottom so it doesn't come off that easy. But uh, that's it. I like that sound. And like I said, the beauty of it is like if you have a, a bunch of flashlights, what the hell is the thing here? Like this one here, okay? It's gonna go nicely. And this one, or another type. Different, different flashlight, but pretty much the same size, same thing. See, and it does have a nice, it's not even sliding down. Okay, and even if it does slide down, well, it doesn't slide. <laughs> it will stop at the, at the end right here. So, this, just want to share this with you idea about a uh, holster for for flashlights very simple very easy to do and very practical cheers